everyone! Today I will introduce a way to make corrections on a note taking app called GoodNote Form. I work as an art director, but GoodNote is something I can never let go of, and it's such a great app for making corrections to a file. I recommend this app especially for directors in any field, so feel free to try it out. Alright, let me first explain a little bit about GoodNote. I use GoodNote 4, but it recently got updated and there is a GoodNote 5, but I still use GoodNote 4. The reason is because there are some bad reviews for GoodNote 5, so I feel like I should just stick with GoodNote 4 for now. Maybe once the bugs are fixed, I might switch to GoodNote 5. Anyway, I launched GoodNote where I'm going to make corrections in PDF. But we are going to use the Mail app for loading PDF. Usually, files or design work that you want to make corrections to are sent by email, and there's an easy way to load PDF into GoodNote. Use Split View. Open GoodNote and Mail apps at the same time using Split View like this. Then drag and drop the PDF attached to your email to GoodNote on the left side. This way, the PDF is easily loaded in GoodNote. Then click here and start adding corrections. I suppose we all have different ways of adding notes, but I usually circle the part that needs corrections and write things like this logo needs to be bigger, or trim the burger further more, and stuff like that. For instance, if you want to write notes like switch this photo, the one in the middle, with something else, you can open split view again where you can open safari or camera roll on the right side. And you can just drag and drop any photo to GoodNote, as you can see. Use the lasso tool to change the size and you could draw an arrow and say, switch this picture with this one, so that it makes it easier for others such as designers as well. Just like this, we can keep adding notes. It was a bit difficult to see the photo, so I just added a frame there. You can also change the position of the photo using the lasso tool again. It's really convenient, right? There are also markers in different colors. I use them often when adding highlights. What's great about these markers is that even when you draw a line, it doesn't interfere with the black letters. The original color of the PDF doesn't fade away, which is something unique about these markers. Once it's done, I'm going to export and reply to my designer who sent me an email. Click on the tab at the top right and select Export and choose Export Current Page. Then change the file name to whatever you like. Here is something important. Make sure you keep the Export Annotations option on. Otherwise, all of your notes won't be reflected and only the document itself will be exported in PDF. So don't forget to keep it on. Just like this, the PDF file gets attached to my email. Then, just type in your message to your designer or whoever sent you the email. I used the mail app for exporting a file this time, but there are other apps you can use too, and they should be shown in the tab so refer to them when you do it, and choose whichever you like to use. Alright, today I will talk about how to make corrections to your document easily and from anywhere using GoodNote app. There are so many other interesting ways to use GoodNote, and I'll be introducing the ones I find great and useful. So please subscribe! Thank you for watching! Bye bye!